Hello YouTube and Facebook people. Welcome back to my video. This is another haul video. Um, it was originally supposed to be a video from the bins in Colorado Springs, but we didn't have very good luck. It was on Sunday. Um, yeah, we didn't have very good luck, so I'm going to go ahead and throw in a haul that is from today. Um, my parents both work at a school and it was a snow day today, so we went to two local thrift stores and this is what I found at Goodwill. Um, a Walk to Remember with Mandy Moore. I don't know if anyone remembers that movie, but I'm excited to watch it. And then I found a calendar. Um, it's got like a lot of space to write in it for this year. And it was only 99 cents, which if you go to um, Office Depot and try and buy one, they're like 20 bucks. Um, also at Goodwill, this was one of the sale tags, so it was I think a dollar twenty it's just this really really oversized size extra large gator shirt it said gators the bad boys of the bayou and it's just got wow gators I, I love shirts like that uh, the next thing I got from Goodwill again it was a dollar twenty on sale it's just this really oversized striped Saint St. Croix. I don't know how you say that. But I just love the randomness of it. That's my style. Um, the next store I went to was New Horizons. And I got a few games. Last word. The games are $2 a piece. I'm not sure if all the pieces are in here or not, but I figure it was worth a try. And then this one is just in a pickle. They seem like they would be easy games just for me and Chad to play. Oh, and then they had a bunch of shorts. Like, I haven't been to a regular thrift store in a really long time. But they had in their front section just a ton of shorts. And they were really good brands. But since i am kind of um, gotten used to bin pricing, everything else seems kind of expensive to me. So I only got things that I thought would fit me. I didn't try anything on because I figured if it doesn't fit me, then I'm just going to sell it. But all the shorts are $3.99. And I got a pair of Levi's. These are a size 29. And they're just a Bermuda length short. That's more of my style. But I found some other ones that are cute. I don't know if they're going to be too short for me. So I'm an old lady now. That's my cat. <laughs> That's Polly. <laughs> um, this is a pair of Hudson. Size 28. With the rolled hems really cute. Uh, these are a Lauren Conrad size 6 and it's just a light wash rolled jean. And I think these will look really nice. Sorry. Come on, focus. And that made it worse. There we go. Um, paired with my random oversized t-shirts. This is a pair of Kendall and Kylie size 29s. And it's just a pair of black rolled shorts, high rise. And that would be the dog Bella. This one is Eddie Bauer, size 8. And I just really liked the pattern on these ones. Kind of old lady ish, but that's okay because I am an old lady now. Um, these ones I really liked. They are the North Face, size 4. But these actually seem pretty big wide for a four, so these should fit just fine. Yeah, just a pair of hiking pants. And then the last pair of shorts that I got, they say they're a size 10, women's 10, but they're high rise, so I wonder if that's why they're 10, because that doesn't seem like a very big 10 at all. Like, I'm pretty sure these will fit me. But it's just a pair of Patagonia shorts, like a thicker canvas short. <laughs> um, and that's all I got from the thrift store today. Um, when we were at the bins, Chad came over to me <laughs> and he brought this big popcorn tin like you get at Walmart. And it's full of, let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five of these deep cleansing washes. Oh, you can't see it with my light. 
second. Kind of right there. Proactive. New. Like, they still have the plastic on them. Brand new. Proactive. Five of those. And that's a big tube. And then he found three of these cleansing ones. The number one step in the proactive system. I have one in the bathroom already that I'm using. These are the big containers. Three of those. And then he found three of the toners. I have the other one in the bathroom. But that's all. Like, these are big ones. And that's a lot of proactive. And that stuff ain't cheap. It's all brand new. Plastic still surrounding everything. That was awesome. I think that was probably our best find of the day. And I honestly don't even remember what all I thrifted. Um, it was only on Sunday, but I forgotten everything. <laughs> so, it'll be a surprise for me as we go through it. This one is for me. It says, go against the flow. It says, don't be confront. Wait, let me see. Don't be conformed to this world, but be transformed. And then it's got the fishies on the back for me I like my random t-shirts especially like old vintage ones and I love when they're white like on the white shirts those are my absolute favorite um let's see this one was for me random it's by Amy Jess the tags uh, the size tags ripped out it's um it's a cactus scene Dolman sleeves. I don't know. I think this will look really cute with any of the shorts that I just bought. I swear, the older I get, the more random my taste in clothing gets. Case in point, this one's for me too. <laughs> it's a sweater by Art Unlimited Sportswear. It's a size medium. And it is this beautiful sweater with a pack of wolves in the nighttime with the moon and even the sleeves have stuff on it it's so cool i'm such a nerd i love it look even the back like every part of this sweater is decked out and i love it so much um this is my first time finding um oh wait no this one's not it well for this too this is athletic girl um size large it's a size large it like looks like it's brand new never been worn such good condition really cute workout top but I figured this could fit like an extra small even probably a small woman it's really cute for a kid <laughs> be really cute on a, an adult too um, this one I picked up because it's 100% cashmere it's Ann Taylor it's a size large and it's a cute pink simple sweatshirt top short sleeve I thought that'd be cute for springtime that's for my posh closet so is the athletic girl uh, this is also for my posh closet it's just a Columbia fleece it's a men's extra large on camera it looks bright red but it's more of like a burnt burnt orange red and it's like in perfect condition really soft still no peeling so I grab that um, this is for one of Chad's nieces. She's really girly and likes dresses and that was just adorable with all the little cats on it. Really cute. That's for her. Um, a bra for me. <laughs> Another sports bra for me. I don't think wearing used bras is gross because you wash them anyway and chances are the shirts that you're getting my girls these days don't wear bras at all so I don't really see a difference just my opinion this I picked up for one of my nieces I'm not sure which one we'll just see who it fits it's a teen size 14 16 but again it's in excellent condition just this really light pink fuzzy soft sweater really nice this is the one I was saying that I've never found before. Uh, Iv Iviva? I don't know how to say it, but it's just the Lululemon for children. And it's in excellent condition. Like, really, really good condition. 
And I don't really sell kids' clothes. I think I have, like, one kid's item in my closet right now on Poshmark. But I couldn't pass that up. That's really cute. Um, these I picked up for myself. They are just an Ari size medium. Just a pajama short. Really soft. These I picked up for myself. They're size 6 by... Who are you by? By Jennifer Lopez. I've never tried any of her jeans on before. But it's just this cropped pair of pants. And I feel like just looking at them, like the butt part is bigger. So I'm thinking these might actually fit pretty good because I've got a big butt. <laughs> so hopefully that helps with that. Oh, I forgot. I got my mom a bra. And these are for me. They are by the brand Just Living. It's a size small and it's just a lightweight pair of cotton shorts. Um, I lost a lot of weight um, just eating healthy and last year when I was still in the process of losing weight I bought a bunch of shorts last summer and they won't fit me now. They'll be way too big now so I'm trying to restock on my shorts and summer clothes. This I picked up for my brother. It's just a Fila size extra extra large. He's a gym teacher. The one that I'm always getting athletic shirts for. And there was a light stain on the front. You can't see it right there. You can see it? Yeah. But uh, yeah, my mom's really good at getting stains out. So hopefully she can. I thought it was worth the try. It's a nice shirt. This is for Poshmark. Yeah, this one's for Poshmark. It's a pair of Patagonia leggings. And I think it just had a little bit of peeling in the crotch, but I can just use my sweater shaver and get rid of that. And it's a wide leg black yoga pant. I like picking up Patagonia. This one doesn't have a size tag in it, but it's just a quarter zip REI, like a base layer. And it's like a, a bluish gray. It's coming off way brighter on screen. That's for Poshmark as well. Um, Chad picked this up for one of his family members. I'm not sure if that's for his niece or nephew. It, feels, it seems kind of small. But they really like Minecraft. Um, this one I picked up for myself. It's just Alfred Denner, size medium. And I thought it would be really cute for spraying or a cooler summer night. But this is a short sleeve sweater. It's it's like a minty green, but it's not coming out the right color at all. But like again, that would go really cute with pretty much all those shorts I just picked up today. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna like bend out of frame to grab this stuff. This is a Columbia size medium. Where are you? No, sorry, size small. And it's just a really lightweight, like it's a, it's sheer, and you can see through it. But just a sheer short sleeve shirt. And the last thing that we got at the bins was this, and I was so happy to find it. People were going crazy in the um, the clothing part of the bins, like digging real fast through it. Nobody ever digs to the bottom. I think I annoy people when I dig all the way to the bottom and go slow. I was taking my time and I was on the last bin in the row and I found this sweater and I pick it up to look at the tag. It's missing, which is always a bummer. But I kept looking at it and feeling it and I was like, well, I'll wear it. It's really nice. Like, it feels really well made. And it's cute and it has pockets. It's like, fine, I'll just get it for myself. So I was looking for the wash instructions while I was at the bins and then boom. There she is, Lululemon, and everybody passed it up because they weren't taking the time. I'm not high-fiving you, I'm trying to get my camera to focus. Uh, high-five. Knuckles. There we go. Whatever. Am I blurry? But yeah, nobody saw it because nobody was taking the time. Oh god, it's so pretty. I mean, part of me is like, sweet, I got a Lululemon sweatshirt. And then part of me is like, dang it, why did I have to see the brand? Because now I'm not going to keep it, I'm going to sell it, but that's okay. I guess. 
Seriously, what are we focusing on? My pile of clothes? Did I put my head down here? Look at me. Anyway, that's the end of my haul. Um, we will... Wait, if I come close. <laughs> uh, that's the end. Sorry. It's going to be a blurry ending. There we go. Um, probably have another haul up on sometime next week. We like to go to the bins on Saturdays. So hopefully I'll have one next week. And I will also have a video from my mystery box from the Thrifter Wonderluster. Hopefully up shortly. So be looking out for that. And yeah, that is it. If you saw any, I didn't have very much. But if you saw anything you liked, go check out my Poshmark closet at Bella Milk. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!